So let's go ahead and test the app. We cannot test the terminated uh, callback because if we terminate the app it will get disconnected from the debugger. So we will just go ahead and test the background callback and handler because that is the only option we have for now in the debug mode and if that works I think the terminated handler will also work so I will put the app in background now and I will send the message so the background handle just log handing a background message and my message is there now I will tap the message message from app that was in background so our background handler for the tap of the push notification is also working now the next thing is to extract the uh, data from the message and accordingly perform some event so let's go ahead and do that let's exit the app for now and for that we will use the handle message open handler so what we will do is that we will check the message data message that we are getting as the parameter and we will check the data property of type type and uh, one property value we will put as chat and another property value we will put as profile so if the message data type is of type chat then we will navigate to chat screen and if the type is not of chat type and if it is of profile or any other type then it will navigate to profile screen and now let's run the app once again and the message that we will send should have data so we have to uh, fill up these fields we have to select a target we have to select a schedule and these are optional so this is the important part that we have to give a uh, custom data so here we will put uh, type and we will put chat and sound we will enable so let's see what happens Now when we send data then it takes some time for the message to get delivered. I don't know reason for this but when we don't use other fields and when we just send the title and message it is pretty fast. 
so we will have to wait a little and see how things happen okay so remote notification was sent okay but uh, i didn't put the app in background so i will do that now and let's duplicate this message and resend it and this time it should work ah oh, unfortunately the app got disconnected let's run it once again still the message is not completed so i hope the app starts running before the message gets delivered else we have to resend the message okay so i think the message is yet not delivered because it's showing active but not completed no this message is taking too much time what i can do is that i can clone the message and the app got disconnected again if the app stays in background for a long time then it gets disconnected okay so the notification is here and i will tap on the notification and i directly land up on the chat screen you can see and i can tap the go back button and i will go to the home screen now let's put the app in background and let's one send one more notification this time we will change the data from chat to profile and we will schedule the message to be sent now let's see what happens ah oh, they have got disconnected again okay but the notification is here and i will tap on the notification uh, again i am on chat screen i think this is the old notification Okay, the notification is here and I will tap on the notification and this time I land up on the profile screen so I think uh, it is clear that how we can handle the messages and how we can extract data from the messages and according to the data that we receive how we can perform task so these are the uh, various things that we can do with push notification that is firebase push notification i hope you found this video informative and uh, okay so the app is running still running so uh, we don't need this for uh, now so let's stop it so 
If you like the video, do give us give it a thumbs up and stay tuned for the next uh, Flutter video. We have covered most of the important basic things and now we can move on to building some apps because most of the things related to uh, Flutter is covered and now we can build some great apps some interesting apps uh, to utilize the things that we have learned so thank you so much guys have a nice day bye bye